Yeah, hi. My, my name is uh, Bartosz Żelasko. I'm the captain of Armada 7802. Uh, all three vessels are uh, under process of mobilization. It's obviously a very challenging task, especially that considering the fact that the company is setting new standard in the shipping industry. So since we've been here in um, Norway, we've um, mobilized uh, most of the Sionics launch and recovery system equipment on vessel number one, and that will have the two HD Schilling ROVs on it. Uh, when it comes to vessel number two, that will have the uh, Kongsberg launch and recovery system, and that will have the uh, two Leopards uh, ROVs, as well as all of the survey equipment. Um, vessel number three, and that's going to house all of the uh, Geotech uh, heavy duty and ultra heavy duty launch and recovery systems for the Geotech equipment. So we're here on 7801 doing the mobilization of the payload and survey equipment. Uh, we're about two weeks into the mobilization, so we have a variety of different sensors being installed. Uh, currently, we're working on the deep water multi beam system and the commissioning of the topside systems. The next stage of our mobilization, once we've uh, gone through and confirmed the equipment is completely uh, tested, is to move into the uh, integration phase, which is where we bridge the gap between the vessel sensors and the remote control center. We'll soon be uh, mobilizing the uh, remote scope equipment, um, and that will mean that uh, soon we'll be able to feed our data back to the remote control center in Southampton, and I'm uh, very much looking forward to um, seeing us do that for the first time. So in this first remote control centre, we have two main types of environment for remote operators to work in. We have the desk station, which is more for remote supervisors, and we have the bridges behind me, which provide a, an immersive visual environment for, for, the, for the operators who need to look at a lot of data and information. Um, and on the bridges particularly, we've, we've, we've hit three really exciting milestones. For the remote payload operators and ROV pilots, they've now completed 100 operational dives uh, using our test environment. For the remote surveyors, they're now connected into our Armada 78 and accessing the real sensor data in the production environment. That's one of the last hurdles to overcome before we can go into full operation. And for the remote, remote marine team, we're also conducting tests with the systems on board and all of the uh, remote control systems are now fully installed on our first ship and quickly followed on the other ships. And now that this environment is all set up, we're just doing our final integration testing and proving that the whole system works end-to-end, -end, ready for us to enter operations this summer.